the fish were alive. They were shoved and crammed up inside of my mailbox. And, um, anyway, I'm letting them acclimate to the aquarium at this time. They are highly stressed. Well, it looks like we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, or thirteen. And um, we've lost the Dumbo ear trait. I don't see any Dumbo ear. These might be the mosaics. So, um, anyway, they're in rough shape from the trip in the heat got some droopiness going on i'll probably put some general cure erythromycin and some ick -X in the uh, tank here and we'll watch them and see how they do thanks rick at bam aquatics god bless is not very good but I wanted to let you know that they really liked being released into this tank which was very nicely cycled I was very pleased I use um, old filter media old substrate old plants old driftwood and um, it's been up and running almost a month now or more I didn't have a heater in here, so I added this heater at the last minute. I will be adding more water, so it won't be so noisy, but um, I went ahead and added the medicated trio for quarantine, and uh, they will be fed two and three times a day with uh, water changes every two to three days just to keep things going and they should perk right back up I also added Two males to the tank that I will film later. I forgot that uh, in my original Half Moon Mosaic breed, I had put a Dumbo ear male in there. And he bred, and so far I haven't seen any Dumbo ear uh, ventral fins, but I've seen some of the Dumbo ear mosaic patterns and so I took two of the strongest looking males that were showing signs, hoping that they have a hidden gene in them that would uh, help bring back that Dumbo ear in these girls. So, wish me luck. Updates to follow.